good Saturday afternoon. It's Saturday, sticky, sticky, icky. Ooh, ooh, ah. What the fuck is up, everybody? Um, hello. Um, this is episode 290 of 402 Sports Talk. I almost forgot my name was. Uh, Rahim Eskali here. Great to bring this episode to you. Um, today we have a lot to talk about, uh, including the Bay State Bulls, proving to the entire state once again last night that they are absolute by absolutely fucking smoking the Granby Rams, 70 to 49. 21 point difference. Um, Tyrese Christie with 20 points, absolutely cooking. From beyond the arc, um, he hit three of those bad boys, and guess who else did? Deion Bird Jr. Um, he dropped 17 points, six for six from the line, uh, three for three also from beyond the arc. These Bay State Academy Bulls are really fucking feeling it. And again, as we described yesterday afternoon, I really think that these guys are going to go somewhere. They're really going to be state champions. Um, the Bulls win, and they are moving on to the MIAA Final Four with a record of 17-5. We have all this and everything you love from the sports world. Episode 290 starts now. Uh, Cowboys to trade uh, disgruntled wide receiver Amari Cooper to the Cleveland Browns. Dallas trades Cooper. Dallas trades Amari Cooper. Uh, Six-round pick to the Browns. Cleveland gives up a 2022 fifth and sixth-round draft pick. Amari's a quitter. Fuck him. Um, the Carolina Panthers are planning an aggressive offer uh, for Deshaun Watson. But honestly, the Saints or the Falcons are probably going to beat him out for, for that offer. A um, little prediction, just being real too at the same time. Who wants to play for the fucking Panthers? Go ahead, I'll wait. Not you? No? I didn't think so. Uh, Phoenix Suns signed guard Gabriel Lundberg um, after he left left the Russian national team, as he should. Um, I don't think any human in our planet on who's not Russian wants anything to do with Russia. And that's just putting it straight up. Send a rocket for me, Putin. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> just joking. <laughs> Um, Dallas Cowboys give starting right tackle Lyle, Lyle Collins excuse me, uh, permission to seek a trade in which would probably happen within the next two weeks or potentially in a couple days when the free agency period begins at 3 o'clock Tuesday. Um, Atlanta Falcons trim down quarterback Matt Ryan's salary cap hit of $48 million to $37. million is a lot of fucking money for a guy who hasn't done anything in quite some time. Believe me, I know. <laughs> um, awesome baby Dick Vitale returns to the court and is recognized during the SEC tournament he's the greatest <laughs> um, Franklin High School comes to Springfield Mass to try their attempt at being the state's best team in number one central Lady Golden Eagles at 3pm stars Amani Lopez and Julie Bahati in Heaven Morris are ready. They got them guns loaded and they're ready to win yet another game. Shout out to the Lady Golden Eagles. Shout out to Coach Mike, the legend. Shout out to Coach James G. Another legend. Um, another staple in our community here in Springfield. Hope y'all win tonight, this afternoon actually. And um, I'm looking I'm looking forward to it. Um, uh, Missouri Tigers, uh, the men's basketball coach, uh, Quanzo Martin, after five seasons, was let go. This move has drawn much criticism from his colleagues and other competitors alike. Um, probably should have had more of a chance, um, and probably needed help recruiting-wise for, um, that job to be a success. You know, you hate to see the brother get fired, honestly. Um, that's it. Let's go for Western Mass Sports. We're going to start that today. Girls basketball preview. For 3.30, we got Franklin coming to Springfield to play the Central Lady Golden Eagles. North Quincy at Norwood for 4.30. Woburn at Wachusett at 5. And Mashpee at Millbury for 7 p.m. And those are the previews for the girls. Now on to the boys' side. Uh, for 3.30, Wachusett at Andover. Needham at Newton North for 4. Uh, Maynard at Drury for 4 also. Uh, Catholic Memorial at Central for five. Go Golden Eagles, go. Um, New Mission at Watertown to end the night at 5 p.m. And that's it for the boys' side of the previews. Um, let's go on to some scores, starting with college basketball in the men's side, y'all. Uh, Indiana over Illinois, 65-63. to 
Uh, Texas A&M over Auburn, 67-62. That's two upsets in a row. Houston over Cincy, 69-56. Iowa over Rutgers, 84-74. Arkansas beats LSU, 79-67. Tennessee over Mississippi State, 72-59. Creighton over number 11, Providence, 85-58. Michigan State over Wisconsin, 69-63. This is week of the upsets, huh? Uh, Duke over Miami, 80-76. Kansas over TCU, 75-62. Kentucky over Vandy, 77-71. Villanova over UConn, 63-60. Purdue over Penn State, 69-61. Um, Virginia Tech over UNC, 72-59. Arizona Wildcats over the Colorado Buffaloes, 82-72. And Texas Tech, surprise win against Oklahoma, 56-55. Now moving on to uh, the women's side. Number 21, Oklahoma takes care of Kansas, 80-68. Baylor over Oklahoma State, 76-36. Number 24, Princeton, 72. Harvard, 67 Number 10, Iowa State, 66, West Virginia, 60. And number 7, Texas over K-State, 72 to 65. That's all for the girls' side. Let's move on to hockey and the professional sports. Pittsburgh over the Vegas Knights, uh, 5-2. Columbus over Minnesota, 3-2. That ended out in a shootout, obviously. Um, The Islanders over the Winnipeg Jets, 5-2. And Washington takes care of... Vancouver, 4-3, almost said Vanderbilt. <laughs> That's it for hockey. NBA, Orlando over Minnesota, 118-110. Atlanta over the Clippers, 112-106. Boston over Detroit, 114-103. Miami over Cleveland, 117-105. Dallas over Houston, 113-100. Memphis over the Knicks, 118-114. Uh, Charlotte over NOLA, 142-120. Wow, high-scoring game there. Uh, CNN over Utah, as you guys probably know already. Greg Popovich is the all-time winningest coach in the NBA. CNN over Utah, 104-102. Toronto over Phoenix, 117-112. And the Lakers over Washington, 122-109. You still suck. Um, but those are your NBA scores. Um, and this is it for episode 290 of 43 Sports Talk. Uh, my name is Raheem Escalai. 46 subscribers over there. We're on Facebook trying to let you guys know that we are the best sports show. We're trying to grow and represent the Western Mass student athlete. Love you all, and I wish you nothing but health, wealth, and success. We'll see you at 291 tomorrow.